Emma, I just, I just don't think you understand what goes on with these things sometimes. You don't know what his plans are. You, you, you don't know what he wants from you. Yeah, and you don't know Joel. God, it's so unfair. You know, all of my friends can have their boyfriends stay over. Just because you obviously hate him so much. I don't hate him. Yes, you do. You hate that I'm making my own decisions about my life. It's not about that. It's about protecting you. Your mother and I love you and, and, and we don't want to see you get hurt. And if you knew me, you'd know that I'm not going to get hurt. I'm going to stay over at his place. I'm old enough and it's my business. You are my business. It's, it's too soon, sweetheart. I know you think you've got feelings for him and I respect that, but... I love him, Dad. Emma, you're not staying at his house. I've, I've, I've made up my mind and it's not going to change. You just don't get it. You don't get me. Emma, you're such a beautiful and wonderful person. You know, I want to put some caution into this. I want any boy to understand how special you really are. I love you. God, she is beautiful. She's got the prettiest eyes and she looks so sexy in that sweater. I just want to get her alone and hold her and kiss her and tell her I love her and take care of her. Stop it. She's your wife's sister. But I can't. I'm consumed by her. I didn't fuck her to give her a nice time. I fucked her to fuck with you. Good fight's never clean. And yeah, she enjoyed it. She's a good Catholic. She loves a guilty fuck. Consider her scar. How did she get that? The one shaped like a question mark. Solved the mystery. She got it when her parents' car crashed. There's a condition called dermatitis artifacta. It's a mental disorder that manifests itself in the skin. Patients gouge themselves, pour bleach on themselves, inject themselves with their own piss even. They put the same diabolical attention to detail into creating the disease as an artist or lover. It looks real, but the source is in the deluded self. I think Alice mutilated herself. It's fairly common in children who lose their parents early. They blame themselves. They're disturbed. You were so busy feeling your grand artistic feelings that you couldn't see what was right in front of you. The girl was fragile and afraid. She didn't want to be put into a book. She wanted to be loved. <laughs>